So my camera stopped recording for some reason, but I don't know exactly where it left off. I was saying that the boxes for the EC stickers fit the width, but they don't fit the length, so they're a little bit short. So stay tuned for a bunch of plan with me's or um, bonus plan with me's, mock plan with me's in this happy planner. I'm excited to try this out. Like I said, I've been really wanting to try a happy planner out for quite a while, but you know, I was waiting for a good deal and I guess I got the good deal that I wanted because I got this planner 60% off. Um, so yeah, awesome deal. So I did pick up some other things. So I just got this pencil pen box here and it was just a dollar. So, I mean, it's nice that I could just put all the stuff that I need in here. I do have my pens in here that I use a lot already. So as you can see, it's just nice and um, a nice little pen case, nothing fancy. I just, you know, been putting my pens like in the ring of my Erin Condren or like the pen holder on my personal planner. So I just wanted to get something where I could just carry everything easily without, I don't know, having a whole load because I just chuck everything everywhere and it's starting to annoy my husband. So I figured why not organize a little more when it comes to my pens instead of just in my planner, right? So um, I did get some more stuff. I did get this X-Acto knife and it's just not anything fancy. I've been wanting to get an X-Acto knife for quite a while. I just liked how this one looked with the um, design and then the pink right here and then there's like a pink diamond or gem I guess on the end of it. And I liked how this one came with extra blades. A lot of the uh, X-Acto knives that I saw didn't come with extra blades and this one costs the same as the other ones. Now I don't know quality wise how the blades are but I mean this one fits the regular like X-Acto knife blades anyway so I'll be able to use those whenever I run out of these. Not a big deal plus I don't plan to use this all the time so I d highly doubt that I'll go through all these that fast. And then the last thing I got from Michaels was a personal hole punch. So this is the small size, I think the one fourth inch. And um, I got this for my personal planner so that I can punch the holes whenever I put washi over the, uh, the sides. So like in this kit here, it doesn't have the hole punched already. I'll be able to do that now. Like in my last kit that I used that didn't have the hole punches, I had to use like the big old paper hole punch and it didn't, it was just too difficult to deal with. So yeah, that's all that I got from Michaels. Like I said, this will be a collective haul and it will have the packages that I'm expecting later this week and it will have um, maybe more packages. We shall see. But that's it for this part of the haul. I will be back when I get more. Okay, so my next part of this haul, I have another misfit, misfit, oh my goodness. I have another misfit bag, and I got this one from Magnolia Boulevard. This is my first time ordering from her. I mentioned in another haul when I got a misfit bag that I do like getting misfits because they do put in, <coughs> excuse me, so they do put in stickers that aren't technically misfits, but they're just like odds and ends. So I do like to get them so I can try out their stickers and see if there's something that I like. I in particular, excuse me, that didn't make any sense at all. I wanted to get this one in particular because she was including June, not June, July monthly items. And um, I really wanted to try this out and her packaging is so cute. If you just look at that. It's her little sticker version of her. Nikki's stuff is so nice. I like this her stuff in this Misfit bag. So in the bag, there was um, a sampler. And on the sampler, it just has a bunch of her functional type stuff and just some decor type stickers. And I like these flags, like the payday flag and the day off flags. Or banners, sorry, they're not flags, they're banners. I definitely want to pick some of those up because I do like those and they'll be nice to mark off. Like the day off I would like to mark off when my husband is off from work. She did include a sample of washi which is really nice. I don't know what it says on there. Okay it says life is good. So much 
fun, I think. Oh, it just has a bunch of different sayings on it. It's not just like one saying. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah. So it was like, life is good, so much fun, a beautiful day. And I guess it just says so much fun. I don't know. Just a bunch of different sayings on it. I like the color. It's super pretty. I like little samples of washi because I honestly, and I'm sure you guys noticed, I don't use washi that much in my spreads or like in my planner really so little samples work really well for me so the first sheet I got is this one and it's just oops some full boxes and I don't know what the kit is called but that's the first sheet and then it came with the headers and like little things that go with the full boxes so I could really do like a white space spread with this and then I got this sheet here let me that has just like black labs. I was feeling her paper earlier whenever I opened this, but I don't have a black dog. Like you've seen pictures of my dogs. He, he's a boxer, so I might give that to somebody. I have somebody in mind that I'll give it to. I just wanna see if she would actually like it. And then what I wanted this misfit bag for is the July monthly kit. And that's the first sheet that has like the top washi or whatever you want to call it then there's the other sheet that has like the um, date covers for the days that aren't part of the month and then some other functional things and then this is the last sheet that has the sidebar stuff which is really cool I haven't used a monthly um, kit before so I'm excited to try this out and I'll probably film it for you guys, showing you the first time I ever use a monthly kit. Just so you guys can see how that goes. And then, actually, I got, like, the full kit, pretty much, for, like, June, except for the full boxes. So I got the... I keep missing this screen. I got the ombre heart checklist. I got, like, the functional sheet with the weekend banner, the half boxes, and some more of those banners, some teardrops, little dots, and then some other functional stickers, the headers with the little things, and some habit trackers on the side, and then her washi. So all that I'm actually really missing is full boxes, but to be honest, I have a sheet from another shop that I got that I could use the full boxes for with this. But yeah, I like her paper. Her paper is really nice. You guys, if you haven't tried her out, definitely try her out. She is from Louisiana as well, so shipping for me came really fast. I got this yesterday. I'm sure if it wasn't a holiday, I would have got it sooner. But since it was a holiday, it just it wasn't. I couldn't get it anytime sooner. Okay, so another part of my haul. I got two packages in. One actually came in yesterday, but I waited till today to film it because I knew that this package was coming today. So let's go ahead and start with this one. And this one is from Shop Jessica Hearts. If you are new to my channel, you guys, I loved Shop Jessica Hearts. Her kits and her stickers are so awesome. So I was excited when I got to order this one. And I'm definitely excited for her mystery kit coming out this Friday which is the 15th so in the kit or in the package you get her card and it just says thank you for your order Jessica and it has her Instagram handle on there and then the sampler is this here with the um, habit trackers and movie marquee and then the time to plan um, sticker if it will focus there you go and I got one kit and then two of her functional type stickers. So these are new to her shop. She didn't have them before, so I was super excited when she released these because these are right up my alley and I just love them. I can use them in both my personal planner or my EC or my happy planner. So the first one I got is the YouTube mini checklist. I would use these to check off um, when I'm doing videos. So like when I edit, film, edit, and upload. A video in one day I would use this for that and then the next one I got is the to clean three heart checklist and yep yeah, pretty simple not too much to explain about those 
but I love these and I'm super excited. I got these in mattes because I prefer writing on matte stickers and to be honest, her matte stickers look almost just as good as her glossy sticker, minus the sheen from like the glossy stickers themselves. The quality on these and the saturation of the ink are just awesome. So I'm pretty happy about that. I usually get her glossy stickers, so this is the first time I ever got her matte stickers, which I'm, I'm actually liking. So, Shop Jessica Hearts. This is one of the kits that I got. Um, she had this kit as her pre-sale, like her mystery kit. Uh, so, I missed out on the mystery kit, which I was super sad about because I really, really wanted it. When I saw her sneak peek of it, I was like, man, I wish I was able to get it because it's just so cute. But, I know that she releases her mystery kits in her shop for a limited time, so when she released the day that she was going to put these in her main shop I was like yes wrote it in my calendar and made sure that I got it like I refreshed the page until 11 o'clock because she releases them at 9 a.m. on her time but it's 11 o'clock my time so I was sitting there till like at like 10 59 and just kept re refreshing the page over and over again just to make sure that I got this kit so the first thing in there are the date covers and these are optional you don't have to get these they're just the add-on and I always get them because I never know when I'm going to use the kit and I just want to make sure that the um, dates match the week but with the new Erin Condor I won't really have to worry about that too much but nonetheless I still got them. The first page is the headers and you got some half boxes in the gorgeous little weekend banner with the tassels. I just love this. Like the minute I saw the foxes with the crowns, I was like, girl, I need that in my life. So I got it and I'm so excited. I can't wait to use this. I don't know when I'm going to use it, but I'm excited. And then the next sheet is your ombre boxes. And I love how she used the crowns instead of like the hearts the traditional heart and then these ones down here oh my goodness I just love this and can you see this like this fox on here has like a hint of like the foil in its tail same with this one and in this one these are so pretty I just oh my goodness and then the next sheet is your little things with some functional items and again so pretty I just love these flags this quarter box here is just gorgeous I can't she knocked it out of the park with these every time she comes out the new release she just knocks it out of the park like it every time it's like better and better each time so I know I am a diehard fan of shop Jessica hearts and I will be buying all of her kits for sure because I just love her stuff so this is the washi page you got your bottom washi and then some washi strips and then the full boxes can we talk about this this is so pretty you guys like i can't i just can't i cannot wait to use this really i just can't wait to use this, this is so gorgeous so the next thing i got is in this bubble mailer i didn't want to pull it out because it is a mystery kit disclaimer this is the little miss papery mystery box if you haven't got yours yet or haven't seen any sneak peeks this is the time that you will exit out of this video if you do not want to see the sneak peeks i know not everybody got their boxes yet um so i didn't want to show this unless you are wanting to show this so i'm about to open this package if you don't want to see what's in it please exit the video and then watch this later <laughs> anyway so it comes in the black little mailer the first paper clip is this little cute guy here and he's green and it's just like a planner and I love it. I wanted these paper clips because I don't have any like super fancy paper clips for my personal planner and I'm so excited for this. She's so cute. I like it. The next one is this gorgeous, gorgeous knitted bow. Like this one here is speaking to me. It is so pretty and like it just seems so delicate but gorgeous. I love this. I just love the aspect of this. Oh, I forgot to tell you. This green one is from Bookends Planning, and that's the information there. If you want to check out their clips, 
This one is from the Paper Unicorns and that's what it looks like there. I'm super excited about that. Okay, so let's go ahead and get into the Stamplers. I'm gonna pull all of these out really quick just so that um, you don't have to hear all the crap, but um, I'll be right back. Okay, so I got everything out. I don't know which one to start with. The first little sampler is from Let's Plan It, and that's that there, and it just has some functional items on there. I'm super excited about these because I do do half week spreads and full week spreads on my Instagram, so I'm excited to use that. The Happy Meal delivery is pretty cool. These um, inspiration type stickers are cool. The Sunday Fun Day is obviously really cute. Bought more stickers, sorry not sorry, so so cute. If you know anything about Let's Planet, she has these stickers, like these sorry not sorry stickers set in her shop. So there's a little sampler of that, love that. The Frye sticker, I don't know if you can see that right there and then the let's plan it's some functional stickers and let's play let's play let's pay bills sticker so that's from let's plan it and I like her shop I do have stickers from her so I'm definitely excited about that one um, this one is from Pookie Bear Cuties and it's just like a decoration or decor sheet and it just has some decorations on there with a weekend banner I'm excited to try her stickers out because I haven't tried their stickers out before and I have been eyeballing them for a while. So I'm excited to try those. And then the next sampler is from Love for Stickers. Also one of the shops I have been eyeballing because of her little, I don't know what she calls these, but her little girl stickers are so cute. Like work it out, let's go shopping, some functional stickers, jamming in my planner, do the laundry. And you got some more functional stickers, another little girl in the weekend banner. This payday or day off flag is cute. The planner right here is adorable. So those are those on Love for Stickers. And I just like how they match, which is what's really cool about getting these mystery boxes when you get stickers from other shops is they really tend to match the kits, which is nice. So you can get a few uses out of them. And then this one is from It's Planning Time. I have some It's Planning Time stickers and I love her stickers. I actually really love these like cut it out um, header type stickers because I do use these in my personal planner. I did use a personal planner kit from her in my personal planner this week and I just loved how it turned out. So I'm excited to get this because I'll actually use this in my personal planner. At least that's my plan. So you get some functional boxes here, some functional icons, and then the headers, and then some dots on the side. And there's plenty here, like laundry day, workout, car wash. Like I love these. I need to find these. If I want to, I want to see if she has these in her shop because I would love to get those. So that's the last sampler. And then onto the main attraction of the box is the Little Miss Papery kits. And it's this one here. I love this color scheme a lot. Some people don't like it, be I don't maybe because of the green or something. The green is my least favorite color, but all together and put as a kit, I like it. For me, I am liking the more folly type sticker kits now. I'm leaning a lot more towards fall colors probably because I have a lot of summer kits already and I need more fall stuff to add to my collection and to use in my planners so I'm excited to get this one I did get her kit in matte I usually get her glossy but I wanted to try her matte I saw lemon planning using her matte removable stickers and I just loved how easy they were to pick up like she repositioned stickers like they were ease, like ease like it was so cool I wanted to try them so I got these out also if you haven't seen lemon planning's videos check them out she does awesome videos like she does motion stop videos and they're so cool I just love watching her videos they're super short but they're straight to the point and it's really cool like 
Okay, so I take forever to edit my videos because I do talk through videos and I just want to make sure that everything flows together. Well, I can't imagine how hard it is to edit out the videos that are motion stop that Lemon Planning does because those are amazing and I just know those are probably not the easiest to edit. So props to you girl, love your channel. She is awesome. So let's go ahead and get into the kit itself. The first page is the little headers and I love her headers. I don't know, they're just so simple but yet, I don't know, pretty. The second page is your full boxes and and just like every Little Miss Papery kit, you have nine full boxes and I just love them. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Next page is the nine ombre heart checklists. Again, gorgeous. I love these. So pretty. And my favorite page probably, I don't know why, but it always it tends to be my favorite page is her little things because I love little miss papery little things like she gives you a ton like you have everything that you could work with here and the little things and I just like how they're formatted really I don't know they're super simple but yeah I don't know what it is I honestly I think I've said this before but I just love her little things and then the next piece is the two page kit that usually you can buy on its own and it comes like this so it has the ombre or not ombre sorry the checklist flags some half boxes you have some circle icons and then you have down here some more functional stickers I love her laundry day stickers and her little laptops that come in these kits the coffee cup is gorgeous okay I just love everything on this page let's just be real and then the second and the last sheet well the second page of the two page kit that you can buy on its own but the last sheet of the whole full kit you have your weekend banner you got some decor up here and then some washi and then some more ombre heart checklist and then some more headers and this is a full box so that's all that's in this kit let me zoom you guys back out but I'm loving these like folly type colors I'm super excited to use this I will definitely be using it in fall I'm loving this box okay so I got some more happy mail this is going to be the last part of this collective haul because I don't have anything else coming in as of right now I don't have any pending orders or anything like that I do plan to buy from a couple of shops tomorrow which is Friday the 15th when they do their pre-sales for some mystery kits but other than that I don't really have any plans for any more orders so this is going to be the last of my collective haul so let's go ahead and start with a big one that you can obviously see I did get my happy plant not my happy planner oh my goodness I did get my Erin Condren so the way that I bought this Erin Condren I bought it off of someone um, actually Allie off of, from Craft and Quill she was selling her Erin Condren because she had a duplicate so I bought it from her which it came with everything that was in the original package anyway so I went ahead and just bought it from her because it was a little bit cheaper than buying it straight off of Erin Condren but I still plan to buy uh, hourly this one is the neutral vertical planner and it has the rose gold coil which I really wanted so I'm still planning to buy my hourly planner from Erin Condren but I went ahead and got this while she was selling it so I'm super excited to get this because I'm gonna start planning in this beautiful beautiful planner and use my other one for mock plan with me's or use kits in that planner um, that I just really want to use up but yes I'm excited to get this I plan to buy another cover so that I can change this cover out I like the color on this but I have my eyes on another cover that I really wanted but Allie was so sweet to send me some stickers from her shop along with the Erin Condren so I wanted to share them with you guys because her shop is so cute and I definitely need to order from her because I I really didn't know about her shop until recently and actually her heard about her shop earlier this week like actually the day after I had bought my planner from her from Nicole Alexia designs so yes she's 
I'm definitely gonna be buying from her but this is the first sheet that she sent me and it's just like a mixed bills sheet icon so it just like has your house for like rent or mortgage the light bulb for your electricity bill some TVs for like your cable some water drops for your water bill and then some little car icons for your car payments so yeah I need some of these and I was actually looking for some car icons so this is perfect and then the second sheet that she sent me is movie night and this is actually what I've been looking for for movie night stickers I've been really wanting to buy some like TVs that said movie night in them and then the popcorns because my husband and I watch movies I don't know either every night or every night of the weekend recently it hasn't been every night because we're both studying for some stuff like I'm in school full-time and he's studying for his professional engineering exam or I don't know what it's called exam it's his license for his engineering because he's a um, computer and electrical engineer so he has to get his professional engineering license but he we've both been studying so we haven't been watching too much movies over the weekend we watch more movies than we do during the week but I definitely wanted stickers like this to mark when we watch movies and what the movie is just so that I can have a record and like a memory keeper type thing and then there's pizza night we don't eat a lot of pizza to be honest but when we do it'll be nice to use these and then ice cream I'm a sucker for ice cream and um, I'm trying to cut back on eating ice cream so I hopefully I don't use too many of these but these are the stickers that she sent and I love them thank you Ali I love the stickers I'm in love with the planner and I'm so excited that you sold it so that I can pick it up from you if you haven't checked out her shop yet definitely check it out it's craft and quill and I'll have it linked down below and let's go ahead and get into my other haul so this haul here is from Planner Mail Press. If you've watched my channel for a while or watched my recent plan with me, I have tons of kits from Planner Mail Press. She is one of my favorite shops. I am definitely very, very, very loyal buyer from her. I almost want to buy everything that she has. I did get my recent order. I ordered this last Friday. Yeah, because she opened back up and I ordered it and she sent it out and I just got it today which is Thursday but this is the freebie that comes in it and it's just like some beach type decor and it's super cute she changed up her freebies a little bit so I'm excited she's doing a lot of reformatting on some kits and stuff so this kit here is one of the newer ones I did get one kit and then I got her grab bag and we'll get into that in a second but this kit is called the Diane Collection. Just to keep you guys in, the colors on these are just so pretty and I just love pink. Pink is my favorite color. I've always loved pink. I gravitate to a lot of pink type kits. If there's pink in it, I'm probably gonna like it. So this kit is very pretty and it is using some of the papers that I saw and like fell in love with and was waiting for other shops to use them. When I saw that Planner Bell Press used them, I was like, yes, definitely buying from her because I love her kits, love everything that she puts in them. So this first page has your weekend banner, your headers, a couple of little things, the bottom washi. This is the second sheet and it has the other half of your bottom washi, some functional items, your sidebar items are down here, and some heart checklist flags and I love this new date night like um, I don't know you'll see in one of the kits from the grab bag she changed up the date night she added this like uh, takeout sticker the lazy day sticker this happy mail yes she just has so many good things on here I just love it but that date night sticker is so cute like I want her to sell a sheet of those just that style date night because I would use them my husband and I go on date nights every weekend so yes I would definitely use them up um Elisa if you're watching this I definitely love this date night sticker but let's go ahead oh this planner on the top is just so pretty look at it it's just so pretty maybe it'll focus 
yes I love that she changed that up too and if you've watched any of my previous hauls or any of my plan with me is where I use her kit I rave about her flags because I just love how these flags are just so detailed with the um the picture or like the papers from the rest of the kit so I'm loving that this is your ombre heart checklist and some appointment boxes along the top and then some more checklist flags on the side and then you have your half boxes some more quarter boxes here and on the top a hydration tracker some banner type boxes and then some more functional stickers I love how many half boxes she has I just love them and then I just like how she uses oops I just like the detail that she puts into them and everything like it's just so pretty you guys I love her kits and then you have your washi strips and then date covers along the top and then you have some appointment boxes on the side and then again I love this this one's so pretty and here are your full boxes with the um what are these chevrons on the side but I love this this paper is just so gorgeous. I love, 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 love this. And this quote down here says chin up princess or the crown slips. It's just so pretty. I just, I can't. Yeah, I'm so, I was so excited when she put this kit in her shop. So the next thing I have is a grab bag. She was selling grab bags on her shop. Well, it's like her D stash bags because she's getting rid of a bunch of her older formatted kits and kits that she's no longer selling that have been discontinued so she was just getting rid of them and in the D stash bag she had 15 sheets for $14.95 so just a little under a dollar per sheet which is such a good deal so this is what the little sticker on the bag said and then we'll go ahead and get into the sheets so the first sheet is this one and it's called the Penelope Collection. I did end up getting one of the grab bags that had two full kits and then the last three sheets were part of another kit which the sheets that I got are perfect because I could use them still with like a white space spread. I don't have to have everything but I have just the amount of stuff that I need so it works out wonderfully for me so this is the Penelope collection so bottom washi the headers and little things and then you have this sheet that has the flags some functional stickers half quarter boxes or not quarter boxes oh my gosh half quarter boxes that doesn't make any sense half ombre boxes your sidebar items and then some checklists down here so this sheet is a little bit different than the other sheets because it doesn't have exactly the same items on there she changed it up a little bit so this is the new format in comparison to the old format but the first page is pretty much the same and the second page which is the functional page is a little bit different and then your ombre checklist and then you have this sheet with your half boxes and all of the other stickers and then this is your um, washi sheet and this is the full box sheet of this collection and it's just so pretty I did not know that she had little dogs on these full boxes until I just looked at them but they're so cute and I love this kit super summery and I'm excited to use this. I'm definitely going to use this soon, I think. And then one of the kits that I got, that this is another kit that I got a full sheet of in the D stash bag, is the Serenity Collection. And I wanted this kit so bad, but when she discontinued it, I was like in the middle of a no spin, so I couldn't buy it. Gorgeous, gorgeous. And this is going to be formatted as the old sheet, so it's all good. And then this is the functional sheet. You have your ombre heart boxes, you have your half boxes with some more functional items, and here is your washi sheet, and oh my gosh, this is so pretty. I'm so, 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 so glad that I got this in this D stash bag because I wanted this kit so bad when she had it in her shop. So I, oh my goodness, I don't know how she knew this, but I'm so glad that I got this. Okay. 
Moving on, here are the air full boxes, and again, so, so pretty. And the last three sheets that I got are half of the collection from Fancy That. And this kit is so pretty too, and I love it. Like I said, it has everything that I need for um, a white space spread, so I'm excited for that. But here are your headers, some little things, your weekend banner half of the bottom washi here's your functional sheet with these sidebar items and your other half of the bottom washi and then the last sheet i got is the full boxes so this is gorgeous but that is it for this haul this is going to be the end of my collective haul i'm excited that i was able to end it with quite a bit of stickers for you guys and end it with my brand new Erin Condren so you'll start seeing that beauty in some of my haul or not my haul sorry in some of my plan with me videos and I'm super excited I hope you guys enjoyed this collective haul hopefully I'll have another one for you guys soon if I don't have any soon definitely stay tuned because I am able to buy stickers here and there but it's just very restrictive I don't have the means to buy them as much as I was before mainly because I am in school full-time and fall starts which means higher tuition because I have to take more classes but that's okay anyway Thank you guys for coming. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.